Hello and welcome to this uh, walkthrough video for the upgrade of our Excel control surface scripts from Sigamore. Now in this video I'm going to be demonstrating on the launch control Excel but this is, is an upgrade that's also compatible with the Behringer BCF and BCR2000, the launch control itself and the Akai MIDI mix. Now in all of these uh, kind of Ableton Live controllers you'll know that you get device control. Very simply put, you get blue hand control over eight macros at a time, which is really fairly useful. However, when you start thinking about working with larger VSTs and the like, eight can take you an awful long time to bank through. So in our user modes that we've uh, given over, each of the encoders now controls one of the parameters within the, the tension device that's in focus here. And you can bank between all of the 128 parameters that are available. They're all compatible with our Predator Script Manager effectively, which is a utility that allows you to define how those are mapped and also exposes hidden elements that have only previously been available to the push or the push two. Now, that's really fantastic when working with VSTs, instruments, and you know, Max for Live devices that have lots and lots of parameters available. However, it's a little bit limited when you're working with just a rack. You've only got eight. So if you choose to, uh, let's, uh, let's have a little bit of... You've only got eight at one time. I mean, I, I can affect that, but as I normally work with DJing, I'd like to be able to focus on the first track and kill the bass, whilst bringing the bass of the second track, which unfortunately you can't do without doing this clicking between stuff. So instead, if we press the solo button, what you'll see is we've now got a different set of lights going on. And actually, what's happened is I've got eight blue hand opportunities. Each of the tracks now has control of three macros. To allow me to have full DJ style control. Now how that's achieved is really rather simple. Uh, in each of these tracks, I've got a rack called Isotonic and that's what the script looks for. In fact, I can call it Isotonic followed by anything in reality that allows me to then put a rack in there in any order and it will just find it. This fifth track here you'll see hasn't got anything in there. So if I can just show you, it's so simple. If I drop that rack in, and then select a different track. There we go, straight away, it's done. And the same again. Oh, two in there, sorry. Put one in tension as well. Lovely. And of course this works with the on-screen blue boxes. So I'm now in control with the first track. And let's have a, a play with some of the other bits on there. Really simple control, DJ style mixing, eight blue hands across the tracks that are being controlled by your script. Synced into the blue, red, green, orange, your ring focus box and allowing you to bank through the eight macros available in the rack. As mentioned before, this is an upgrade to the Excel scripts, launch control, launch control Excel, BCF and BCR. 2000 and the Akai MIDI mix. Thanks for watching.